Hard to believe it has been 78 years since the Allied troops invaded the beaches of Normandy. This year, local World War II veterans are headed to France for the ceremonies commemorating the anniversary of D-Day. Justin Shecker spoke with two of them tonight. Justin joins us from our Tampa newsroom. And uh, just uh, a few of these uh, heroes remaining now. That's right, Keith. They were just teenagers when they shipped off to war. Now in their 90s, they can still recall the life-changing experiences while fighting for their country. Many of us realize if they've ever talked to a World War II vet that they're very humble. They are members of the greatest generation. I just go back to they were kids. They were kids and they fought for our country. Malin Greep was 18 and Angel Maldonado was 17 when their service in the U.S. Army began during World War II. Somehow you just want to go and fight. That's what it is. Maldonado spent 18 months in Japan. They, uh, they didn't allow us to go to a restaurant and eat because we didn't know if they were going to poison us. Greek fought in Europe. And I still can see those bodies laying in the street. He witnessed the horrors of the Holocaust as American troops liberated the Dachau concentration camp in Germany. The tanks rolled in and I knocked the gate down and that's where we walked in uh, my group headed to the rail yards. Both of these World War II veterans are headed to Normandy, France for next week's 78th anniversary of the D-Day invasion that turned the tide in the war against the Nazis. I just was very proud to be asked to go. A veteran herself, Amanda Baldwin, says she's honored to co-chair this special trip sponsored by the Florida State Elks Association. And we are free because of what they did and what they did prevented that conflict from coming to our land uh, other than Pearl Harbor. And the Elks Association has also organized trips for veterans to visit Pearl Harbor. The local group leaves tomorrow for France and the ceremonies in Normandy are on the D-Day anniversary next Monday. Live in the Tampa News Center, I'm Justin Shecker, 8 on your side.